morning <laughs> I know it's weird it's 5 a.m. and I just woke up so well I did not really but yeah <sighs> okay guys as awkward as that is I just wanted to show you guys my morning and this is how it basically looks looks every single day but since this was sunday you know sundays have been feeling a bit different since it's been locked down and i wanted to share that with you guys so i hope you guys are enjoying the asmr of the morning <laughs> So guys this time of the morning is my time the only time i can really be alone with myself and my thoughts and um yeah this is how my mornings look every single morning but sometimes i don't drink tea and if you're questioning why i drink water and tea together it's it's become a habit you know the water is for skin and the tea is just for just so i like to do a morning prayer and be grateful for the day and um anything else that i have to include in my prayer and then i do some bible reading a little devotion after that i just like to journal write down my thoughts of the morning sometimes i even just write down my dreams it's not something i do all the time voiceover for this because my voice is sounding crusty since calvary the only thing satan has been able to use against the church is the weakness of the flesh he has had to depend on the deception through the weakness of man's flesh in order to be effective in his work his power in the spirit realm was broken when jesus christ was quickened with eternal life and raised from dead legally satan's hold over mankind was forever broken by the lord jesus christ god has revealed himself to our generation in the spirit we have learned to hear god in our spirit and to know him by his word for the most part he has not revealed himself in a way that we could see hear or feel in natural realm we have had to work by faith and not by sight So guys, I think for the longest time I've been afraid of the devil. <laughs> I know, it's funny, but like, um, my biggest fear was the devil for a very long time in my life. And I think only until last year that I actually felt like, you know what, actually the devil has no power over me. And that he actually has to ask from God for permission, you know, to do whatever he does, you know, to do his works. And so, you know, just knowing that um, gave me a peace or sense of calmness and peace in my heart because I know that God only wants the best for me and he will only allow what happens to me to happen because he knows that more or better is coming for me. So, yeah. Guys, so I want to do my hair and I want to do my nails. But it's so early in the morning and my hands are starting to get cold so i don't know what i should do but one thing for sure is that i'm going to wash my wigs obviously i don't wash my wigs every sunday morning but i like to have activities that i do in the morning preferably because i'll be lazy to do them later on so this is one of them
I recently bought these nail polishes and I wanted to test out this metallic color and um, yeah guys I didn't like it very much so I guess I'm gonna stick with the black and I'd like to choose black or dark colors because I am dark skinned and so putting another dark color on my nails kind of makes my skin look lighter it doesn't look weird you know if I was to use like a light color it would it would be weird you know the pink was funny that's why I only applied it on one hand but hey so this is just a manicure that I like to give myself I like to clean up my cuticles shape my nails you know do the works make it feel professional if I have to do it I have to do it right right Now here's a tip, applying some Vaseline on your cuticles makes it easier for any slip of nail polish that falls onto your skin um, to move. Did I, make that? Did I make sense? But yeah, basically you could just peel it off when it dries off. So guys, this is just a lamp that I use to dry my nails. So guys, it pretty much takes me about an hour to an hour and a half to do my nails in total i like to perfect it So in the end, I just like to, you know, peel off all those parts that were on my skin. Listen, yo, if you are like me and have gained some weight during this lockdown, you gotta put on that shapewear. Okay, I'm joking. This is just tight, but yeah, I mean, it kind of works. It feels like it's shapewear. And yes, we do dress up when we go to church. So we dress up every time we go to church. <laughs> Some people find it weird, but it's a habit of ours. And that's me and my family, okay? I was kind of late, so I decided that I was not going to iron this top. I literally took it out of the laundry, so it wasn't ironed. And so, yeah, don't judge me. Started. Let's go. Thank you so much guys for watching my channel um, Watching this video on my channel. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'd like to do more of these kind of videos I feel like it's therapeutic This is what I like watching. So I guess I should create it, right? <laughs> um, see you guys on Wednesday